nothing but incredible things about this game. Look at all those colors. I know, it's so vibrant and neon and extravagant. Wow. Bear wow. Uh, chill. Let's... I'm, I'm gonna see how I fare. Haha, ha, see how I fare. See fair, see fairing joke. Nautical pun. It's gonna be one of many in this stream. So many. Way too many, in fact. But uh, I'm gonna see how it goes. I, I, I wonder just how difficult it's gonna be. So maybe if I get stuck, I might open up a uh, chat a little bit to help me out. But I think chat's fairly good at moderating themselves as far as these things go. If any outright spoilers show up, I would encourage you, of course, to go ahead and ban those. Or not ban them, but, you know, like get rid of that message, purge it, and then time them out or whatnot. But yeah, anyway, I don't think it'll be too bad. Return of the Obra Dean, if you're not familiar. The new game by Lucas Pope, as you can see right on down there, is the creator of Papers, Please. The, uh, the sadness simulator that we all <laughs> love so much back in 2013, uh, where you play as a uh, Border Patrol agent who is working under the uh, authoritarian realm of Arstotska, which is where the colony of Berstotska and all the iterations of Berstotska originated from. So if you were ever curious, here you go. Thanks to Lucas Pope for that little bit of bearology, I guess. Bear, do the thing more good right. Ban that guy! How dare you? No, it's fine. Have you adjusted the graphics yet? These different There's different color palette options. Are you serious? Hold on. Oh my god. <laughs> I had no idea. I hadn't even clicked the anchor yet. Look at this. Ooh, a Commodore one. Wow. Yeah, somehow they're all worse, right? Yeah, no, oh, LCD, okay, this is, uh... You have returned. This is the look that the uh, thumbnail that I chose ended up having. Apparently it's built into the game. I kind of like this one, actually. This is a little nicer. The blacks are less harsh on your eyes than the greens and weird grays. Sawtooth Nomad! Welcome to the bear pie. Thanks so much for your six months in a row, buddy, and Lord Roll! Appreciate your uh, two gifted subs here to Zaphis and Welcome Shoot. to the bear pile. Welcome on in, y'all. Appreciate it. Thank you. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's... Oh. That almost hurts. Do not like that. Zenith is kind of nice. Seems like it mostly just changes up like one or two of the colors it chooses from the palette. Power Man, thanks for the 25 bits. Bit King! Well done. I'm probably just gonna rock the uh, standard Macintosh look though, just to experience it as the creator originally intended. Right? Reminds me of your classic fat Game Boy. Yeah, exactly. That's what people were mentioning early. It's got that Game Boy aesthetic to it. So yeah, there's not much I know about Return of the Obra Dean. I did play a an early alpha years ago. In like 2014, probably. That uh, didn't tell me much either, so... It's all just kind of a big mystery, just like the game itself. I'm kind of... You know, I prefer it that way. I think it's gonna be better to go in sight unseen. It's a game with a ship. Yeah, that's pretty much all you need to know, I guess. The other part you need to know is that it's got 10 out of 10 reviews on Steam. Overwhelmingly positive. Hundreds of reviews. Saying, wow, this is really, really good. So, that bodes well. Anyway, no further delays. Let's do it. Return of the Obradeen. Begin. Lost at sea, 1803, the good ship Obra Dean. Built 1796, Captain R. Witterell. Crew 51 men, last voyage to the Orient. Cape Rendezvous unmet. Contact East India Company, London office for inquiries or testimony. I'm clicking, nothing's happening. Enter? All right, there we go. Attention, Chief Inspector, Insurance and Claims, London Office. The Oberdeen is returned. Dispatch to Falmouth immediately and prepare a full assessment. The Honorable East India Company. Falmouth, England, to 1807. Company man woke me up. 
Oh, the bit war already Set begins. Oberdin. Oh, I've been saying it wrong the entire damn time. For that job. Seems a bit late if you ask. I didn't. <laughs> What's in the box? I don't know. Hoist it up in a few minutes. Hey! Ow! Carefully. With your hoist. With a lever and pulley system I assume you have attached to the ship. What's in the box? Ooh, wow, look at this. Here we go. Right, hold on, let me get a situated here. Hey, pal. Can I see what's in the box? What's in the box? Ah, oh, wow, well, alright, fine. Crystal ball? I can right click. Hold right click. I assume to zoom in and interact with things. Hold space to climb. Okay. I did have a look at the graphics options in the beginning. Yeah, it's interesting. Oh shit, Sawtooth Nomad! The 1500 biddies appreciate it. Support.exe initialized. That much is clear. I'm really hoping that this doesn't fuck with the bit rate, although I don't think it will. I have no valid reason to believe it will, apart from that it just looks a little goofy. It's very interesting. Can't seem to interact with things yet. Does a bit, nothing you can do about it. Yeah, I figured. Alright, well. Oh, what's that? Huh. Well, I assume I am to, uh, greet the captain or something. Oh, there's a dead man. That seems problematic. Anybody want to clean this up? I'll bit. See? No, I knew it. Two for two on the pun. On the pun train. Leaving the station. Okay. You know, I'm loving so far. I've been given zero guidance. Oh, hold on. Oh, he needs some help. <laughs> How do I help him? Give him like a... Oi! I don't know what to do for you! How about this? A rope? Yeah, helping is for losers, right? Exactly. I don't know what to help him with. I mean, like, I just... I put the pieces it's together myself. I know it's too heavy! Oh, me, I gotta go down there and carry. Alright, fine. Jerk. So much for chivalry in the 19th century, am I right? Jeez. I'll take it. Okay. Oh, take no. it yourself or open it here. I get it, yeah. Fine. Give me the book. Ask him for his papers, please. But I'm Tish. Boss, thank you for the five months. Appreciate it. D. Return of the Oberdin, a catalog of adventure and tragedy. I trust that you now find yourself aboard the Oberdin. I expected this day to come, and my every intention was to tell the ship's strange tale within the pages of this book. Regrettably, failing health has allowed me to produce only the basic outline that follows. Your presence on the Oberdin is critical. I leave the discovery of its fate and the completion of this, this book in your hands. The next few pages will seem bewildering at first. All will make sense in time. Use the Pokemon to determine the identity and fate of everyone aboard, complete each chapter accurately, and complete your Pokedex by guaranteed post to the French Office of Affairs in Morocco. The bargain chapter will remain unknown to you. I possess the details within, but have elected to keep them private for now. Detective Pikachu, you know it. All right. It will indeed seem befuddling, bewildering at first, but... Here they are, all the same. The deck plans for the Oberdin, the Atlantic leg of the Far East route. Sketches of life aboard the Oberdin. Oh my god. 
Okay, this is already... I'm beginning to see... The, the pieces to the puzzle here, and they are pretty exciting. I gotta say, look at this. Yeah, you can see. scroll down the entire passenger manifest. What if you can, like, click on individual people? No, okay, but you can see where they came from. All the way up and down. Interesting. Zoom. Now enhance. Yeah, 1800 style, right? Enhance! I see, yes. Perfect. The detail is clear to me now. Spring, Doc! 43 months in a row? That's a long-ass time. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate that resubscription. Welcome on back in. This is a boring book. Lazy author, am I right? God. Maybe try some content. They can contact me for that. Oh, don't make me go all the way back. Hold on. How do we... No. No! Okay, at least we can do this. Skim through the entire book for... I don't wanna. You can't make me. Don't make me fucking read. Oh, hold on. Hold on, something sneaky. This chapter will remain unknown until you leave the ship and return the book to me. Okay. Undead hippo! Four months in a row. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. Oh, whoop, 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 whoop. Right, yeah. You really gonna skim through the whole damn thing here? Is this all that critical? Okay. We learned those two keys at the end, I guess, which are important components. Undead, thanks for the four months, buddy. Appreciate it. ¿Qué es esto? All right, I guess that's all I needed from my uh, fancy little box there. It was so heavy, it had a book and a compass in it. Oh, God. It's too heavy! Lift it yourself! Love this game. Hope you like it, too. I've heard nothing but great things about it, so... If I don't like it, I'm clearly the idiot. <laughs> Alright. Again, yeah, not a lot of guidance still, so... Ah, uh, stopwatch, huh? Okay, let's see. Oh, shit! Obra did! Captain! Open the door! Kick it in! Unless we break it down and take more than those shells! You bastards may take exactly what I give you! Oh shit! I can move, can't I? Yeah, baby! And thus begins the game, right? Yes. Thus begins Oberdin proper. This man had an axe! Ah, oh, what a cool scene, huh? You can get right up in his business, hey you. It's super hot, yeah! It's, it's the super hot murder mystery game. So, based on the clues provided to us here, I can safely ascertain this man was shot! And now, stay with me. Stay with me. I can- Oh, wait, no, hold on! I wasn't finished ascertaining the evidence! Oh, no! But Bear, who shot him? I was just getting to that! Oh, no. The end? That's it? X marks the ending. How clever of them. Three others were present. Outside the captain's quarters. Who is this? How did they die? This unknown soul met an unknown fate. This unknown soul. This person's face appears blurred throughout the book. 
Hmm. This blurring indicates that you don't yet have sufficient information to determine their identity. But an unknown fate, their fate may be known and can be entered now. Trying to name them while their face is blurred would be unproductive. Carry on and pay attention. Faces will become unblurred when the information necessary to identify them has been revealed in some way. Hmm. I remember. See, I very specifically outlined this. He was shot. By a gun. By the captain. Right? We have to think, I know! Oh god, now I'm doomed. But that's right. Because that was outside the captain's quarters, and that was Captain Robert Witterell. So this unknown soul was shot with a gun by Captain Robert Witterell. Oh, by Jove, I think he's got it! Wow, I'm a genius! That's indeed the location of the corpse. Hmm. Well then. Captain, open the door! They did indeed scream Captain, lest we break it down and take more than those shells. I see, I see. Three others were present. Hmm. Oh, that's saying, that's not saying that's Robert Witterell, that's saying he was shot by Robert Witterell with a gun. He was shot by a man, that's right, the gun didn't shoot him, the man did. These three were there. Interesting. Okay, then. In memento style, we're starting from the ending, it looks like. Well, let's go ahead and close the book. On that case. Oh, we're back! Hmm. Well, there's your face. And there's his face. Wow, memento spoilers. I'm sorry, I... Yeah, spoiler, Welcome memento starts... To the bear pile. ...at the beginning of the movie. Didn't mean to ruin that for you. Special Kel! Special K? I can never determine whether an I is an I or an L is an L. Thank you. Either way. For your, uh... For your subscription. Appreciate it. Okay, you can zoom in on... Oh, this is cool. If you zoom in on them like this, you can see their position in the, uh... In the paintings like that. He's got a knife! So let's have a look at, uh, this guy then. Yep. Yep, we knew that much. Mm-hmm. And that's Captain Robert Witterell. It's a bit creepy, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm. Well, I can't move past the captain here. I guess I should just go ahead and walk out the door. This conveniently placed doorway. Well, there we go. And we're back to the present day. Oh, but look, we got another corpse in there. Oh, hold on, don't do that yet. A renewal. Welcome back. Trog Archer! Welcome back for five months in a row, buddy. Appreciate it. A game about pirates, a game about pirates, a game about murder, mystery, and perhaps the supernatural. Let's find out. Murder on the Obradin Express. <laughs> well, I've done my bit. Let's head home, right? Must be in here someplace. That'll do for me. They're at the bottom of the sea. Ah! That's a lie. Are they pillow fighting? Welcome to the bear pile. Robo Fred! Thank you so much for your Twitch Prime subscription, my friend. Appreciate it. Oh, this dude got his throat slashed. Yikes. Yeah, that is that is a throat slashing. His throat is open. Okay. So it looks like Mr. Captain Man took out yet another by way of knife to the throat. What else do we got going on out here? Oh, shit. Hello. 
What are you doing? Dropping down to assist, is he? Okay, I see, I see. Spooky. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's extra stuff. No! Oh, my narrow eyesight nearly caught a glimpse. Damn it. The flank. He's gonna get him, dude. Mm-hmm. Who is this? How did they die? I know who that is. He got slashed. Where's the, uh... Where's the correct... Oh, knifed. He was knifed by Captain Robert Witterell. I saw that happen. With my, uh... With my, with my death compass. That's what I saw. Or sorry, my death stopwatch. Don't mean, don't mean to be inaccurate there. Captain's a badass. I don't disagree with that at all. Dude is holding his own. Hmm. Their faces become unblurred when you technically have enough information to identify them. But a lot of the time it will be extremely difficult. It's clearly not just by looking at their face and saying, See here, this is his face. It's not blurred anymore, right? Because that's not been working for me. I also did not mean to back out of that just now, but here we are again anyway. So it looks like, so far at least, it gives you like the limited time to scope out the crime scene in the beginning. And then asks you to put the pieces together, but then it, you can get out and just investigate it fully again anyway. So I wonder why that is. This is also the aftermath of what had happened before, right? He shot the dude, it seems, and then the other guy came in here. Which, uh, yeah, no, this is definitely a continuation of it because this guy was going up the stairs before. And now he's come over here. Launched himself over the, uh... I'm gonna, I'm gonna reveal my nautical ignorance here. The aft? The bow? Of the ship? One of those two? Flung himself over there. He's gonna, he's gonna initiate the flank. Bow is the front, stern is the rear. Okay, yeah, I got, I got one of the two, right? So yeah, we're we're experiencing a uh, continuation of events here. L is zoom. No, E is zoom. Right click is zoom. Same functionality, I guess. Yeah, we know who that is. All right, that'll do then. Does he have a spear? Yeah, what is he holding? This is what he was fighting with. That just looks like a metal rod of some kind, unless he's got, like, the edge of it inserted into his armpit here. A bonkin stick. Yeah, that's what he's got. To the portal. It might have been in his shoulder. Yeah, it's possible. Captain might be bleeding out. Wow, yeah, no, that definitely looks like it was in his shoulder. That is a pointy end of that stick. Mm-hmm. I think Captain's bleeding out, man. He's probably hurting pretty bad. That might be him. Let me peek around here a bit, though. One of them pokey sticks. Yeah, one of those old pokey sticks they had in the uh, 1800s. Well, let's check this out, I guess. Burn it. Fishing stick. Doubles is a fishing stick. Oh, yeah, no, that doesn't sound very good. Whoo, boy. Yep, he was he was choking on blood, this guy. So in case we were curious, safe to say this man. Still experiencing the aftermath of being knifed in the throat. Captain got another one, dude. Yeah, look at it. Oh, 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 bad ass. Captain Witterell removes the pokey stick from his own armpit, thwacks the assailant on the flank with it on the skull, 
Oof. Oof. Oh, that's gotta hurt. That's why he's the captain, that's right. Yeah, that and the mustache. Clearly a big part of the power. Oh, I, I spent way too much time admiring the captain's badassery. Heard you wanted this back! <laughs> well, Alright then. I'll have it all. I'll tell you how he fucking died. He got thwacked. He got clubbed, didn't he? He got, uh... I guess clubbed is a, an accurate description. What else would it be? It's none of those. I guess the dude got clubbed. He got poleaxed, yeah. Crushed? Struck? Nope. Not crushed. It's gotta be clubbed, I'd, I'd say, right? Dude got clubbed. It was clubbed by Robert Witterell. We saw it happen. Still don't know who that is, but... He did. Does it say fucked anywhere? Yeah, he got fucking owned by Captain Robert Witterell is what happened. We saw it. We saw him die. Sometimes there's more than one correct answer if it's unclear. Okay, okay. Makes sense. Triple kill working on a kill tack here for uh, good old Captain Witterell. Anybody else want to feed him? He's hungry. Hello. Oh, shit. We didn't even notice this at the start. There was... Wonder if she's alive. Huh. I sleep. Yeah, no, this is... <laughs> Resident sleepers in chat. We got Captain Robert Witterell being the ultimate badass of the year. Right outside her front door. No, I just... I sleep. I sleep. This is... This is boring. Standard stuff. She didn't actually technically count as a witness then, right? Yeah. Alright then. See you later, Robert. Going back to the Twilight Zone. Well, hold on. Let's look up here and see if there's anything I missed. Yeah, I didn't think so. He does this all the time. I'm so sick of it. Constantly battling back assailants. Surviving at the edge of his life. It's so boring. Well, we're gonna have a look in here then, obviously. Oh, she died! Oh, no. Oh, wait, no, here she is. Oh, she died! Oh, no. Abigail. Your brother. My friend. I shot him. Dead. Well, there's that mystery solved. I'll be with you soon, my love. Please. Oh, he's forgive shooting himself. Me. This dude's shooting himself. For everything. Yeah, this dude's shooting himself. Yeah. No, I mean, I figured it out. You didn't have to put me face first. <laughs> That's not a good place to do it. Why wouldn't you just do it in the head? All right. Whatever. Oh, that's the captain. Oh, shit. A renewal. Welcome back. 35 months? Mess up the mustache? Dude, good call, actually. I don't know what I was thinking. Gotta, gotta give him the chance for a legendary legacy. Never mess with the stash. All right, fair enough. My dude just got knocked the fuck out. He is gone. Wow. No one else was present. Oh, who is this? 
Who's this? This, my friends, is Captain Robert Witterell. They can now be identified. That's right. Use the book and the pocket watch to gather enough evidence to deduce, or information to deduce their identity. Revisit memories on the ship using the pocket watch to study relationships, appearances, and activities. Use the book maps, crew manifest, and artist sketches, along with the individual con conversation logs, co 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 conversation logs to find clues about the names, relationships, appearances, and roles. There were 60 people on the ship when it left England. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. All right. Great. Well, that's Captain Robert Witterell. I'm going to go ahead and have to let you know right now is that, my friends, is Captain Robert Witterell. Shot with a gun by Captain Robert Witterell. Where is he? Where is he? Um, was shot with a gun. End of sentence. I guess it's the only choice I have. That's not true. Wait a minute. I know that's not correct. Fates are validated in sets of three. Correctly identify at least three people in their fates to have the information type set in the book. Well, I know this isn't right. There's no Captain Robert Witterell. Uh... Where did you... Where did you go? No, turn him out only off. I don't need to be... I don't need to be preserved of this. I'll let you know when to do it. Hold on. And why was it on? Oh, there's a suicide option. See, I know I don't want to I don't want to be sitting here in agony not knowing why I didn't do some stupid thing like choose between shot and suicide. Yeah, that's not that's not preserving me. Captain Robert Witterell shot himself. There we go. Yeah, that's easy. All right. Yeah, fair enough. Well, this is Abigail, then, I guess. I think it's fair to assume. I wonder if there's only one Abigail on the boat. We can probably easily find out. Not the glossary. Hang on. How do we get to the... Uh... Probably just skim real quickly? There's probably a quicker way. Q, right? There we go. Q button gets there. And then the crew... Complete crew and passenger manifest. I look down here. There's an Abigail. Abigail Hoskin Witterell. Welcome to the bear pile. I assume, based on the fact that they have the same last name, that that's probably the one we're looking for. Along with the fact that there does not appear to be another Abigail on board. So, there we go. That was Al Abigail Hoskin Witterell right there. Shiny child! Shiny Child, thank you very much for your Twitch Prime subscription. I appreciate that very much. Enjoy your badge and emotes as well. Thank you for the bear hugs. Y'all appreciate it. Well, okay then. We're going to find out really quickly, I'm sure, what happened to Abigail. Welcome to the bear pile. Valiatsu! Keep the bear hugs a-coming. Thank you very much, Valiatsu, for your Twitch Prime subscription. Thank you, thank you. Hey, RMR. Four corpses? I assume is what that means. Okay. We're not done here yet. We got five! Four kisses. Oh, right, of course. He's dead! Whoa! 
Uh oh. Whoa. Whoa, whoa! Whoa! Oh my god! Yeah, I figured this was getting supernatural pretty quick, huh? Holy shit. Hi, buddy. How are you doing? Oh my god, he just... This dude got torn in half. You can let him go. He's gone. Yikes. Wow. So many people here. This is an awesome scene. I'm sure we want to try to figure out who that is. Is that Abigail? Yeah, the music is great too. So many! The Kraken! The Doom. Yeah, no, I figured it wouldn't be very bitrate friendly. Unfortunately. Corpse was moved post mortem. Hmm. Ten others. Man. Martin, where is the captain? Have you lost your mind? My husband. This is the captain's wife. Probably safe to assume then. Hmm. Let's have a look at the crew again. Is there Mrs. Witterell? Or was it just Abigail? I think Abigail might have been the only other Witterell. So it might just be Abigail. Oh, you know, it would make sense. Maybe Abigail got hit by a mast. We don't know necessarily that she died from it, though. Maybe safe to assume she died from the injuries later in the bed. Hmm. Let's get back to the doom. Oh, wait, no. It was, uh, where was it? So. True, yeah, I did see her corpse, I guess, right? So I think it's safe to say she was crushed by rigging. And this is Abigail, almost certainly. Abigail Hoskett Witterall was crushed by falling rigging. Moved post-mortem. True. Oh, yeah, so maybe... Yeah, that might have just been her corpse over there. Which explains why she wasn't waking up <laughs> during the fight. <laughs> well, I feel a little worse for this artificial construct. All right. Well, I think that's safe to say then. Whoa, we're shaking. What the hell? Apparently, it doesn't feel very good to be here. I'm not surprised. Hello. Monka, shake. Monka, ass. Whoa. What? What'd I do? Uh Hmm. Can't go that way. Yeah, it really does, doesn't it, Tridium? This game completely just throws you into stuff. Remember this guy, yeah. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, like very little guidance. What the hell? I'll follow you, little fairy dust. Sure. 
Uh-huh. You gotta keep seeing this guy. Alright. Find out what happened to him, I guess. Wow! Jesus Christ! The audio design, I gotta say, is pretty spot on so far in a really gruesome sort of way. Wow! Wow! He got torn in fucking half! Oh my god! There's his other bits! Holy shit. Yeah, that'll work. Get him with the stick. Jesus! Kraken can't even see us. He's tearing us in half. He's trying to toss a weapon over to our boy here. What is this? Set this beast free. I'm sure it could take it on. My god. There's so many other people here, too. The guy torn in half, his face isn't blurred anymore. Do we know that? Twelve others. Oh, I know how he died. Let me go ahead and let you know how he died. He was... Torn apart, yes. Torn apart indeed. By a terrible beast. That is very accurate. It's just, yeah, we'll go ahead and label that as suicide. <laughs> Okay. And there were a lot of other people present. Oh, this is the dude that the captain clubbed. Okay. Interesting. I wonder if we have any other results. Not yet. So many blurred faces. Okay. Oh, so it looks like it does this when I have the capability of discovering a new corpse in the, like, the main area. So I've got to find who I've got to interact with here in order to discover that, I suppose. Let's see. wonder if I have to, like, zoom in on them to discover who it is. I think I had to do that last time. Oh! I can just click and then it finds it. That's easier. And then go boop! Seems to be progressing pretty naturally now. Absent any sort of direction. It's the goat! Wait a minute. Whoa, oh my god, wow. Kaboom! He is probably in pieces after that, I gotta assume. Open the book while examining a face to flip directly to the sketch. Okay. And then how do we see who it is? Oh, I see. And then we can... Ah, there we go. I got it. Yeah. Because it goes directly to the magnifying glass on that guy. There it is. 
Knife by Captain for sure. Yeah, no, we got that much. Who's this? Next to him on the picture. Interesting. Interesting. Ooh, we can probably go down here, can't we? He's collapsing. Oh, that's the dude that got torn asunder, isn't it? Well, this man exploded. I will fill that much in into my ledger. And hopefully that provides us some more progress. Who is this? How did they die? Explosion. This unknown soul was blasted by an explosion. How do we know he's not still alive? I mean, he was right there. He th I think he died. I think he blew up. Let me go ahead and say he blew up. I did find him by examining his dead body, right? Yeah. Throw it, throw the powder, sacrifice yourself. He did look pretty exploded, yeah. Man. You know, maybe he survived. Let's just allow for that possibility, right? What's the Kraken's name? Deborah. We gotta go down here. Are you assuming the Kraken's gender bear? Are you? I just said its name was Deborah. Oh, here we go. Yeah, no worries, Chill Reef. No worries at all. You want to preserve this for yourself? Absolutely do so. Woo! Yep, he's dead. My man got crushed. Cannon crushed! It's the new hit mobile game, Cannon Crush. Flick your finger and you crush crew members against the wall. Hello. That's a cool dance move, homie. I like it. It's like, yeah, throw down, dude. Woo! No doors for me. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What's all, all, all this fanciness over here? I can't get back that way. Shot by Abigail. Yeah, I think that's safe to say. He was crushed by a cannon. Match three crew members and you clear the cannon. Oh boy. Lose cannon! Find he did say find your footing and then he got crushed. So I mean that's kind of on him, isn't it? Crushed by a cannon. That's conveniently specific. Hooray! Oh no. Not another one. Not another one. They just keep coming. More and more dead. Love the design so far. Audio and presentation are on point. He did. Yeah, 
Yeah, there's a couple of dead bodies on this ship. So it would seem! Wow! I don't know about you guys, but I'm not going to be taking any cruises on the Obra Dinn anytime soon. <laughs> I'm a streamer. His head's gone. More and more. Wasted souls. Oh, that's our guy that got torn in half by the Kraken. I remember you because your body tattoos. Secret goodies? Open the ch open the chest. Open the chest, Sam. Yeah, he got put back together. Look at him go. He's firing on all cylinders now. Get it, cannon joke. How do they die? Hmm. Everybody blew up. Who lost their head? Who was the man what done had his head exploded? That was... Yeah, I didn't realize there were two dead in that scene. That's... They all died from death, right, yeah. Hmm. Well, yeah, I should have examined the body. This is a goof on my end, I guess. Where's the other corpse? This one guy, this guy was here. It looks like he was wearing clothes. So I think the first dude is that corpse, and then I didn't find the other one, I guess. Well, shit. You never found the second guy's body? Well, it looks like this was the guy that got decapitated. Was decapitated by... Hmm. You can close and open the book as much as you want. Oh, okay, so hold on a second. We can just go look at it again. So yeah, he was... This certainly seems like... Ah, yeah, definitely Top Hat Man, okay. So we can go ahead and mark that now. Decapitated by the beast, I guess. Would you call that the beast or an explosion? Hmm. Or maybe it was... Oh, wait, no, 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 that was... Hold on, that was the fuse, right? Yeah, no, that was the cannon. So, hold on, that was not that. That was... He was... Decapitated. It's not a straight decapitation. His arm was gone, too. Okay, that's true. So, he was maybe, like... Exploded. I think that's safe to say. This is not a pure decapitation. He was kaboomed. Yeah. Just shot? All right, because you can do shot by a cannon. Yeah. He was shot by a cannon. But then... We'd have to assign a person to that. You can see his top hat in midair. Oh, can you? I can't even- oh, there it is. Yeah, I see it. There's a little hint. And then... Hmm. I'm not seeing, like, so... It's difficult to parse apart the pieces here. Very difficult to see what actually happened, but it looks like 
this cannon fell over. The beast, oh shit, the beast grabbed this cannon, turned it and fired it at our boy here, right? The beast shot him with the cannon. That's some next level shit. De definitely suicide, right? Yeah. Is that boy two outside the window? Is it? Um, I don't think so. Hmm. So assuming he loaded the cannon, and there must be a, must be a suicide, right? Yeah, there was another guy under the cannon here, I think. I can't seem to zoom in on him. Maybe if I just click, it'll take me to that corpse. I don't know what happened to the other guy, though. Well, yeah, there he is. Okay. There might be a different... Hmm. I was gonna say, it might be taking me to a different one, but I think it is actually just gonna take me right to this guy. There we go. Whoa. Aha. Uh -huh. I see. I see. He, at the moment, is he being grabbed by the beast? I think so, kind of. Or he's being kind of like crushed up against that stuff. It looks like they both got shot, though. Because he was over here right behind this guy, so he must have just been blasted. Then this guy must have died, too. Hmm. Hello there. I kind of see a little bit of him. Alright. Yeah, yeah, he blew up. Well, no, this is the guy. Actually, okay, this guy got crushed. This dude got cannon crushed. The hit new mobile game we're all falling in love with. Crushed by a cannon. And then the other two boys were the ones what done got blown up. Cannon crush! So we can go back to these boys. And where is... There it is. This poor soul was shot by a cannon. By a terrible beast. Show enough. That's indeed how it went down. We just gotta find out who they are. All right then. That's that. Who knew giant iron guns could be so dangerous? No kidding. These roasted marshmallows, tasty. All right then, pretty good. Back through the twilight zone, I guess. Love the music. It's terrific. Hmm. Yeah, why not? Oh, wait, this is the one I already did, isn't it? Oh, that's the same guy. Okay, hold on. I'm a goof. I'm a goof. I'm a goof. I'm sorry, I'm a goof. Ah, I'm a goof. 
Can I get out of this? Doom! Oh, here we go, yeah. Rip. Okay. Is there any uh, designation on the corpses to indicate to you that it's a memory you've already seen? I'm trying to determine that for myself right now. There isn't? Alright. We're alright then. Let's go wandering about, I guess. Oh, the watch opens. Oh, yeah, no, okay, that makes sense. That does indeed work. Right. Can I open? Oh, I can't open these doors. I haven't even been trying to do that. Maybe, like, open this stuff up, too? No? Okay. Oh, that I oh excuse me. Pardon me, sir. Do not shut me in. I gotta find a corpse in one of these rooms, right? Maybe this isn't the way to go right now. Brand new door opening tech. Working flawlessly. Ooh, shit. This has got to be the one, man. This is where all the corpses are. They're hiding something from me behind this door. I knew it! Knew we'd find one. Oh, no. You're cut. Don't leave me. Bear up, son. I'll stay with Bear you. Bear up! Ah! So, mother, I, I, I tried my best. Aye. I, to pull him back, to save him. You tell her yourself. <laughs> Brennan, bring the surgeon's kit! Oh, man. Bear up, sonny. You'll get through this. Who is this young strapping lad? I see. <laughs> Notepad in hand might be useful. I might have to open up a, a Word document or two, huh? It certainly seems like that might be uh, this kind of game here. Okay, okay. What's that? The surgeon's kit? I'm busy murdering people outside! These two men... Were clubbed to death by him? Perchance? Seems to be the, uh... Logical conclusion we can derive. I refuse to take notes. It cost me like two hours. Seems a lot of people are recommending it then. Oh shit. Escape. You can name people when you see them, not just on death. Well, that's good. Okay. Oh, let's see. Tell Pete's mother I tried my best to pull him back to save him. Hmm. I don't think we've got enough clues to piece that together yet. So he died there. From his wounds, safe to say Brennan didn't uh, make the rescue here. Yeah, true, right? One of those guys must be Brennan then. One of the guys outside? And maybe safe to assume that the dude holding his hand to his ear was Brennan? Let's see. I don't know how he died. Brendan Green, creator of PUBG. Oh, making a cameo, huh?
Oh, he got killed. Are you Brennan? How many Brennans are there on board? A couple of unknown people, too. Hold on, I'm not seeing a Brennan. Brennan! Brennan! Where are you? Did you see him? I didn't see him. Where'd he go? Brennan. Press X for Brennan. Unknown is just a tag, not actual people. Oh, okay. How am I missing him? Oh, I've been looking at the first name. Last name. Henry, Bre Henry Brennan. There he is. Okay. So. There. Hey! I'm a genius! All right. Woo! Three lines. He's done it. The wizard. Well, all right then. Yeah, just 57 more to go. Hooray! You. You got clubbed by Brennan, didn't you? Bet you fucking did. Let's watch the magic happen. And by magic, I mean violent assault with a blunt object. And by watch, I mean watch listen to. Oh, well, that wasn't too much. Brennan clubbed him in the face! That's our man. Do I know who this is? No. But he's dead. Clubbed with a bat. Just a straight up bat slash blunt object. This dude don't have no face no more. Brennan is violent. Good lord, Brennan. Why couldn't you rush in here to save our boy, what's his face? Bleeding out on the ground right now. Zipping back a minute to find out what's going on here. Well, all right then. Brennan slammed those faces into each other with such force that they collapsed. What a massacre. Clubbed by Brennan. This unknown soul was clubbed by Henry Brennan. I remember. I remember. Yeah, I, I saw. I was there. It's pretty cool the way you're uh, able to slowly piece all this together, and then it adds those extra details as you go. Neat. Okay. Well, there is the second one here that was also clubbed by Henry Brennan. Clubbed by semen. Oh, boy. One of our favorite pastimes. Hello. Can I... There we go. Flawless. Excuse me, Captain Cannon. You have a plan? Yes. The big ship was in the east. 
Mutiny? Treason? Mutiny! Mutiny! Whoa! Jesus Christ. That man's face. That explains his face being gone. Because that's how it got destroyed. Wow. Yet now we know where his face went. All over the floor and ceiling. Horrible. And here's Crawling Boy. This unknown soul was shot in the face by an unknown attacker. And we don't know who either of these guys are, right? Oh, no, no, we know that that guy was clubbed by Brennan. Right. Right. Well, all right, then. Can we go upstairs? Oh, it's Brennan! Hey, Brennan. And the other guy. Anything else? Oh god, no! Hmm. I wonder who they were talking to. This man was shot by a gun in the face by an unknown attacker. I know that much. Now we're back up here. Oh, shit. Huh. Is this the captain? I think this is the captain. Yeah. What's he doing? Wong. There it is. Good day, clearly, yeah. Right here, I'm aware. Thick butt. Ow. <laughs> Go. Boom! Holy shit. Who are you? Ain't seen y'all yet. You're dead. Blown to bits. This one too? Stabbed perhaps? All right. There's Captain Witterell. Firing at this unknown assailant. There's our boy Brennan. Oh no, there's our boy Brennan. Along with the other dude. Interesting. What are you doing? You're the guy that the captain clubbed to death. Interesting, interesting. What was going on down here at the time? This guy got stabbed by that guy. Oh shit. Everyone here hates each other. Who is this, how did they die? That's the one that done got shot in the chest, right? My boy was shot by a gun, much like many. Yeah, yeah, he did. Okay. There's only so many Kraken attacks you can take before tensions run high. I, I suppose that's pretty reasonable. I still don't know who that is. We know who you are? 
This is the dude who got his face blown off. So wait, oh, was he... I think they were actually involved in a struggle, so he survived maybe and then shot his face off. And there's this guy. Hello. Who was also clubbed to death by Brennan. Hmm. That's the one what did the face shooting. Mm. Mm-hmm. There's not much going on over here now. Not you. Aha. Uh -huh. You have returned. Charismatic insanity. Thank you for seven months in a row, buddy. Appreciate it. Welcome on back. Wee. Last one. Move quick. You'll not take the last part. That sounded like somebody got stabbed. That, that was another stabbing. That stab? Oh, wow. He, whoever that is, was stabbed by him. Whoever that is, who was also shot. Okay, then. And they are on the boat off the side here, right? And there she is. Oh, so they are attempting to escape on the boat, it seems, right? They're taking the last boat away, and they're getting angry at them for taking the boat off. Clearly. Uh, who is this? Who is this? Show me who you are. Show me who you are, lady. I want to know. I can't zoom in on her. What the hell? Is that the captain? That's the captain, yep. Captain said let them go, right? Yeah. There's a few more people we recognize. Well, my boy got stabbed by a sword. It's easy enough to identify. Last one, move quick. You'll not take the last boat. Paul, look out. Hmm. Paul? I guess this is Paul? Paul Moss, first mate steward. There's only one Paul that I can see. Paul McCartney, it seems clearly, yeah. Alright, I think it's safe to say that is Paul Moss was stabbed. There's no stabbed. Killed by sword. By an unknown attacker. Okay. Fair enough. Renewal. Welcome back. The sale! That's some of Amazon's money. Well, thanks, bud. Appreciate it. Thanks for the two months in a row. Welcome on back in with Twitch Prime. It was Paul Giamatti. Damn it, I knew it. He's always sneaking into these murder mysteries. Oh, I didn't even see this guy. I love that. The audio design is exceptional, in my opinion. He dead. He dead, boy. What's with the vape cloud? It's trying to be hit. Easy now. You're in a bad way. This is squid. Where is my Frenchman? The squid's gone. Your mate was torn apart. Not that. The 
beast is dead? How? How did you kill it? We didn't. It left with the storm. The captain came up from the hold. Said he chased it off. <coughs> you should rest. A curse, Lysand. Does that live for nothing? He did. How he died. We know that dude was clubbed, and that dude was shot in the damn face. Hmm. Oh, yeah, the fact that his arm is missing certainly seems like a, uh, A cause of death. Maybe there's a chance there of that being the, c the case. Oh, there's a little hatch underneath here. Interesting. Is that the captain? I think it's the captain, yeah. Can we open these doors? No. There's our door. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say that the fact that his arm is missing might be the cause of death there. Who is this? Who is this? Did he say... Is Verdant? Is that German? Is anybody from Germany? No. Hmm. Something like, damn, right, yeah. And yeah, he also said something about the whereabouts of his Frenchman, exactly. So, he was talking presumably about the only Frenchman on board, which would be Charles Minor, who was bosun's mate. Which means, if we find a guy named Bosun, would that be more than likely the uh, candidate we're looking for? I know they speak German in multiple countries. I was just, you know, making the attempt at a quick identification. Austria, I suppose. Yeah, that would make sense too, right? Oh. Oh, Bosun is title. Oh, that's a title, not a name. Oh, so that's this guy. And he's from Austria too. Yeah, no, that's got to be him then. Okay, so Alfred Kristil was... Well, he had his arm removed... You might want to brush up this chat, this fucking chat acting like they've ever heard of this word prior to this game. Come on. Be real with me. Let's all be ignorant together. Let's not pretend to be well versed in our nautical terms. Everyone knows a boast. They do? No. No, it's not common knowledge. It's ridiculous. Torn apart does seem right. Yeah, no, that seems that seems like it would make sense. Well, if you're a sailor, oh, okay. If you're a sailor, by all means. Alfred Clestiel was torn apart by a terrible beast. I should probably have a peep at the glossary, huh? Yeah. Well, all right then. That's that. Right. Did we learn anything else from that section? I didn't see any other area that we could uh, examine. Q is an index for the book. Let me have a look at the glossary. Why not? Foreman in charge of general crew operations and the equipment required to... Sh you know, everyone knows. Everyone knows the, bo the bosun. This is the foreman in charge of general crew operations and the equipment required to sail the ship, Bear! Duh! Fuck it! I learned that in first grade, you moron! Obviously. Oh, that's it. 
That's the whole of it. All right. Uh, purser. Counts for all cargo. Well, that wouldn't make sense. Please look up the poop deck. There is no poop deck. There's only two pages of glossary, right? What's a top man? Higher rated seaman specializing in work above the deck. You know what I'm talking about? Those higher rated seamen specializing in work above the deck. You know what I mean? I bet this guy doesn't even call the forecastle a focal. I don't even think I pronounced the abbreviated version of it right, but you got me. You goddamn got me. Hey, you. Where's Bottom Man, right? No kidding. Yeah, I think we've, uh... I think we, we've fully cleared this. Fair enough. Uh huh. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Later around, Zen. Have a good night. All right. Let's see. Is this a toilet? This is a toilet, isn't it? Yeah, it's got the curtain and everything. Is it... N Wait a minute. This is where they cook, isn't it? You gotta make efficient use of the space, I guess, in a boat. Alright. Yeah, two holes next to each other. You gotta at least allow for dual pooping. Going below deck now. Far, far below deck. That's fair, yeah. I guess a ship isn't always known for its privacy. What's going on with you? Are we doing the... the death recap for this animal? <laughs> We actually are, aren't we? Let her here. One swing. Get true to skull and stone her brain. I'll cut her throat when you've done it. Here? Yeah. Come on before she kicks off. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> you all right there, sir? <laughs> Never been on a farm, Charlie. Find your shoes now. Fucking Christ. <laughs> oh, wow. It's Charlie. Oh, that's helpful. Funny that we learned his name from that event. <laughs> okay. His name's Charlie. Charles Minor. That must be the Frenchman that he was referring to, right? Let's see if there's maybe another Charles. Hold on. No, it doesn't look like it. Well, there he is. Charles Minor. We've located the Frenchman! Oh, there's another Charles? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hold on. Oh, shit, yeah. Oh, no! Well, he's still unknown then, I guess. We don't know which which Charles it is. Well, hold on. I bet we can piece it together with the context clues we've been provided here, right? Although, I like, I was going to say that he would probably be standing next to his... bosun. Right? But... Hold on, let's have a look around here for a sec. Frenchman was torn apart by the squid, right, yeah, so that's not gonna be him then. Accents too, right, yeah, so, yeah, I think, did we hear him talk? 
I guess we'll find out at the end of this. Who are you? He exploded, that's right. And then this is an unknown man, okay. Anything else going on around here? Oh, we got another corpse. This dude's got a pair. Oh, no, what is that? Monkey! Monkey! Cool. There's a lot going on in this scene. Strange hairy parrot, yeah. <laughs> okay, huh. Large cow was slaughtered for its meat. And here we get the recap of this, uh, talking here. No one, no one sounded French. So I think it's probably safe to assume that this Charlie is the other Charlie, the English Charlie. Oh, we got two more guys over here, too. Let's go mark him. There he is. That's Charles Hirschdick. Great. That means you can identify the French Charles, too. Can we? Right, because he was the guy that was uh, torn apart by the... Uh, by the beast. A renewal. So to do Welcome that... Back. We want to go to the Doom. We're going to find what happened. Guy that was torn apart by a terrible beast. Was it him? This must be the Frenchman then, right? We got a couple people who were torn apart by Deborah, right? Yeah, so maybe it wasn't this guy. The dude doesn't look like the... Hmm. Yeah, I, no, no hints now, of course, I guess, right? Let's let's hold off on identifying that. What's going on with you? Same as the other fellow. Some lung disease, not consumption. <coughs> Made worse by the cold. We it spread? If so, we'd all have it. They must have picked it up at Alaska House. Mm. I checked all hands just now, and everyone is healthy. And him? <coughs> what are his chances? I gave him some laudanum. We'll see. <coughs> so he's gonna die. <laughs> all right, this is basically what that translates to. Hmm. Doubt we know who this is. Yeah. This is the doctor, presumably. Who we have seen before. I haven't seen him yet. A lot of them is for horror, not blight. That's right, yeah. Clearly they've misprescribed this guy already. Can you identify the doctor by his role? Oh, good thought. Yeah, I didn't even consider that. Let's see. Maybe there's only one doctor aboard. There's a surgeon here. Henry Evans. Oh, uh, there's a surgeon's mate as well, though, so maybe it's one or the other. Let's see if there's maybe another doctor or something like that aboard. Hmm. Not looking like it. So, with that, with the possibility of two options there, I don't know if we can necessarily 
make the designation. Interesting thought, though. Oh, hold on. What is that? Oh, won't let me see it now. All right. From lung disease. There's a lot of things being said here. Not consumption. Leads me to believe he was just exposed to something and there's not any sort of food problem aboard. So let's just say he died to illness. Oh, not, not that. This unknown soul succumbed to a tragic illness. Okay. Well, there we go. I thought this was a corpse, yeah. How many fates have you got so far? I've only gotten three locked in. I've gotten bits and pieces of others, though. A couple of the names. So, yeah, we got a ways to go. A ways to go. Pardon me. Russian. <laughs> is that Russian? No, I don't think that's Russian, is it? Well, the first one was Russian, right? I don't know what that is. Hold on a second. Oh, that was Hindi? Uh, let me have a look then. We do have someone from India. Hmm. There's Russia. There's th oh, a few from Russia. Okay. Don't you know Hindi when you see it, Bernard? This is... Again, this is all just meant to expose my ignorance to various... facets of culture. Single Dane, right, yes. Is he going in for a... Oh, he's just got a lantern. I thought he was going to punch the guy. Let me hold your head while I beat the shit out of you. Hello. This is a pretty relaxed setting here. Hmm. This was... Yeah, I was going to say, that's the same guy. So then, this, these guys must be sick. They're like, I assume this one's probably sick then as well. Okay. And then... Seems as though... We are to derive from context clues who these people are. Not necessarily try to figure out who died in what way from this scene. So... Oh, these are... Hold on. This is coming from the table. Isn't it? But now... Okay, so he's saying his name. All right. So the name of the guy that we're looking at here that died must be Sied. So let's try to find him. Let's have a look. There he is. Solomon's yet. And then... Don't know how he died, but... I think it's safe to assume that because he was laying in a hammock adjacent to the other guy who also had the lung illness, that he probably acquired the illness too. So I'm just going to go ahead and put that for now. And then... Hmm. 
That's that, I guess. And then you. Hmm. I don't know who was talking. It was probably him. And since he was speaking Hindi... Let's see, have a look down here. Syed is dead. There's... Ah, there's too many choices. Yeah, could be any of those three. Why are they all illiterate? I think someone said this in chat. Yeah, why is every Indian name illiterate? That's so weird. Renfred Rajub, Abraham Akbar. Abraham Akbar, probably. William Wasim and Solomon Syed. That's funny. All right. Well, yeah, I guess we can't uh, make any solid determination there yet. The guys at the table, though, were speaking Russian. So hold on a second. At least two of the guys at the table were Russian. More than likely all three. Because I'm assuming they wouldn't be speaking Russian to each other if the other guy couldn't understand them. So these are probably the three Russian seamen. Right here. Please explain. No, I don't want you to explain. No, I get it. I guess we probably don't have to mark them yet. But... No, not illiterate. Alliterate. Like, same letters at the start. Uh, I don't know if there's anything else over here. I think we're just gonna go ahead and bounce. Like we get we get little little bits of information from this, but nothing that we can again make a solid determination with. All right. Sometimes it's worth guessing anyway if you have a hunch. It doesn't seem like there's any pat or any penalty for putting in an incorrect guess, right? It's just of course gonna make it more confusing for me later on down the road when I don't know which ones I've made marked as guesses and which ones are definitive. All right. Here's that. Already got you. Can't go under there. Let's see. All oh, right, yeah, we can go through doors. Huh. Interesting. I'm liking the aesthetic more and more the more I play. Like, it's, it's, it's beginning to just feel normal, the way things look. And it hasn't been disorienting at all, like I kind of expected it would. There have been a couple of places where, like, I couldn't really parse apart, like, the different pieces, which was... Slightly annoying, but otherwise it's fine. Jeronon! Four months in a row. Welcome back, buddy. Thank you. Appreciate it. Welcome on back in. Hmm. I feel I've done quite a bit already. Oh, is there a door open? Hold on. Ugh. Hang on.
in the game, not in my house, so thank God. I don't think there's anything else left to do in here. I'm just trying to make sure. I did this one, right? Yeah, definitely. Just trying to be thorough. We've already been in there. There, there is a door open in your house. How I know this is irrelevant. Oh, good. Great. I think I needed to go down those other stairs. If only I had a shift run button. Oh, this one? No. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What's he doing? He's there. Oh, shit. On your toes. Chinese. Suck the lifts and lower the boats. The whole crew will be on us. Give it up. Whoa. You have returned. For dead. Nine months in a row. We have ourselves a Chinese woman. I wonder if I'll be able to get that easily enough. Probably not. Probably not. Okay, let's wait. You are unknown. You are also unknown. And you are dead. Having been shot by the unknown man. Also have another- Oh, good lord, is that through your dick? Oh, thank goodness. It's just through your legs so you can bleed out like a dignified man instead of... dickless. Oh boy. What the hell? Huh. Maybe he hangs left. Oh, that's true. Shit, I didn't even think about that. Did you say someone was Chinese? Yeah, because they were speaking Chinese. Is that not safe to assume anymore? Is that considered racist? Well, this man was uh, shot. Shot by a gun. By an unknown attacker. That much is certain, at least. Hmm. Give her here, will ya? Captain. Captain. Oh, huh. Hold on. This isn't Captain Witteral, though. This is... Hmm. Referring to this person as Captain? Interesting. Oh, was the- oh, was the Chinese woman trying to scream for the captain for help? I see, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, yeah, and this guy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That's what happened to him. Yay! Death and mystery! Horrible beasts rendering our crew members asunder. 
Woohoo! So fun. Puck Sheng Lao, you have been found guilty by self confession. Well, there's a name. Quiet. As captain of this ship, and by the authority of the East India Company, and thus the Crown of England, I sentence you to death by firing line. <laughs> Mr. Wolf, when you are ready. Right, sir. Ready, men. Another name. Aim. Fire. Wow. Yeah, he's dead. Mr. Wolf? Oh no, that's Mr. Wolf. He was shot by a beast with a cannon. This is Mr. Wolf. Christian Wolf, the gunner. Done. Yes! Yes! All right. Bop, 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 bop. 54 more. Woohoo. Okay. Now, there are so many people in this scene. This is the captain. We know that much. Don't have to figure out anything else about him. Who are you? You were crushed by a cannon. There's so many people. And we have over here is Miss Lee, I believe, according to the context clues. So let's see if we can identify her. There she is. And. Hmm. What are you doing? Taking notes back here, huh? Oh! E.S. Is there like a scribe on board the ship? Huh. Artists, yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Was there an option for artist? Well, we'll find out soon, I guess. Alright, so I gotta look at the uh, transcript here just to make sure that I... Oh, that's not Lee, it's Lim. Hold on. It's not. <laughs> you're in the. Yeah, you're not, you're you're a topman royalty. That's right. That's what you are. Okay, hold on. Lynn. Where is Lynn? I don't see a Lynn. Um. Probably in like the. Oh, there's the. Oh, there's the artist. Edward Spratt. I didn't even notice that guy, too. So, let's just... It's on this list somewhere. Oh! Right? Miss Lim. Yeah, there she goes. Okay. Now, Hawk ha Seng Lao was killed by firing squad. That's gonna be easy enough. Wherever he is. There you are. Was shot by, well, hold on. There's probably like a firing squad, right? Or maybe not. 
Yeah, I guess just shot by a gun. Well, no, because then it would... Hmm. I guess this is just this and this, just by everybody. I guess we just got to figure out who shot him. Okay. Well, that'll be interesting. So. Man, there's so many people. Quickly, let me do this. Since we now know who that is. And identify Mr. E.S. as Edward Spratt. There we go. Now. Man, there are so many people here. It's the monkey! Woohoo! Hmm. Oh, it's Brennan! It's my boy, Henry Brennan. Oh, and this is the scene. This is the very scene of the painting, and that's why he's painting it, of course. Of course, it all makes sense. Brennan is the only one on this firing line we know, though. Well, we can do that, at least. Henry Brennan, where are you? Brennan. There you are. And then... There are other parts of this that I'd be able to identify too, I'm sure. Let me have another look at the uh, context clues here. Uh, let's see. He murdered that person whose name I'm sure I will mispronounce. Mr. Wolf and you're ready. Good, good, good. This limb, it's too late. I think that might be 28 others were present. My God. All right. Well, let me do this now. Oh. There we go. Hello. Do you get shot first? Hello? Who is there? Who is that? Is someone hurt? Senor Nichols, is that you? A name! What are you doing down here? Oh, hello, yes! All fine here. Just, uh, sorting some things. Watch your step. Here, let me help you. That's not very helpful. That's not very helpful at all. Ooh. What's that? Can I have it? I want it. It's the game-winning gem. That is Hawk Sing Lao. Must still be alive in there. Huh. Do 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 do. Don't know who that is. Don't know who that is. Can't go this way. over here. That's our portal. Nothing. Nothing. Not a lot going on here. Nichols. Hmm. 
This is the dead one. Identifying Nichols as the one that hit him. Did we... I didn't see any sort of weapon or anything. He must have stabbed him. But I didn't see a knife. I'll have another look. Is he holding a weapon? I think so. Yeah, that looks like a blade. Yeah, I think he stabbed him. Let me go on the other side real quick. Kali mod is hard, obviously. That's what it kind of looked like. It's like, did you just punch him really hard? No, I think it's pretty safe to assume he was stabbed by Mr. Nichols. So, let's do that. Was kill or oh, knifed by Mr. Nichols, by Edward Nichols. There we go. All right, then. And then there was this other guy, too, which is Sook Bao, right? I think. Or Seng Lao. Yeah, my bad. Okay. There we go. There's a lot of aggressive acupuncture on this boat. <laughs> Okay. That's that. I kind of want to go back to that scene. I feel like there was more to it. Hang on. I'm going to go look at that again. <laughs> Seng Lao, you have been found guilty by self-confession of the murder of Nunzio Pasqua. Nunzio Pasqua. Quiet. As captain of this ship, and by the authority chicken. of the East India Company, and thus the Crown of England, I sentence you to death by firing line. <laughs> Mr. Wolf, when you are ready. It's gonna be like a. Ready, men. In. Death by firing line. No. It's all just shot. Shot by a gun by a specific person. It wasn't just one person. How do you. Weird. Okay. They're just hanging out. Hmm. Not seeing anything else. cool that you get this perspective of it. Alright, anyway. I'm gonna get out of here. Go wander elsewhere. Let's have a look. How recent is this game? This came out, I think, two weeks ago. Very, very recent. New release from the creator of Papers, Please, Lucas Pope. It's phenomenal stuff so far. I've really enjoyed it.
Oh god. Oh no. Oh god. Well, slightly better than well, no. It's it's pretty bad. <laughs> it's the artist. Oh no. <laughs> it's the artist. That was sad. Damn it. Only got to tell one story before dying on the shit. Whoa, whoa, what happened? The world will never know his talent apart from this one painting. Hey guys. If only you knew what was happening. That's absurd. <laughs> That's crazy. Well, we know how the artist died. Edward Spratt was, uh, what would you call that, I guess? Welcome to the bear pile. The kindled! Thank you very much for your Twitch Prime subscription, my friend. I appreciate it. Was cannibalized by the beast. Was devoured by a terrible beast, I guess. Crushed, I suppose. By the beast. Oh, yeah, I guess he wasn't eaten because his bones are still there. That's fair. Well, there we go. I think that's right. There it is. And it didn't even get upstairs from this one. Ba ba ba. Sneaky little dust. Trying to fool me. Let me on. <laughs> Over my dead body, you bloody Dane. Huh? How is that? You oh, Danish person. Get in the boat. This is an important clue. Don't forget. You killed my brother. What? That was an accident. The robes. It wasn't his fault. I saw the whole thing. Nice. Oh, I shouldn't have waited so long. No, don't. Club in the face. Oof. Oof. Hurts, don't it? Oh my! I never expected violence to happen here! My goodness! Oh, nothing else, I guess. Alright. That's it. Boof! Slam him in the noggin. Someone here is Danish. I know that much. That's about it, though. So hopefully that is enough of a clue alone to make an identification.
Let me on. Over my dead body, you bloody Dane. Hmm. So, the Dane is the dead guy. Hmm. Him? Seems to be the only one. Right? Yeah, okay. Well, that's... There you go. You got clubbed. Oh, Bredane. <laughs> All right, cool. But by whom? Right, yes, that's the ultimate question. This, this little funny looking dude. The unknown assailant. Whomstf. By whomstf. The goat's still locked up. Okay, well, there it is. How far in are we? I've been playing for a little over two hours. We've completed six so far, definitively. So, technically 10% of the way through, I guess? So many disappearances. Who is this? Who? What fate befell them? Seven wayward souls disappeared during the events of this chapter. Yes. Yes, indeed. I feel like you can go more aggro on the name guessing. Yeah, you think so? Yeah, I might be able to. They're so fuzzy. Consume hydration! Do it. Alright, let's have a look at the uh, map. The ship. Hmm. This is not going to help me. <laughs> I should just wander. I don't get any info from that. Yeah, I might have to go through the existing memories again, see if maybe I can get some extra clues put together. Maybe if we go back to some of the first ones, I'll be able to see some new stuff now. Let me try going over here real quick. Well, actually, I bet there's doors over here. Yeah, here we go. Okay, nothing. There. It's got to be downstairs. It's not going to be top level. Come on. I'm going to go all the way down. All the way down. And let's see. Yeah, the cow already. What's this? Oh, it's just a weird effect. I think I've already opened these doors, too. Hmm. Where did the artist die? He was second floor, right? Someone's saying there's a new path up that way. I'm gonna just open up chat to suggesting where this person is because I don't want to wander around the ship looking for this. If I've just got like one stray dude I've got to investigate. Newly opened door. In the back end over here. Can you open your book to the most recent entry you got? Can I? Does it do that by way of a certain button? New door open. 
open somewhere. Not this one. No button. Yeah, of course not. <sighs> Body on the outside of the ship. I was looking around the windows, too. Let me go back down on this side. Orlop deck, port walk. Which one's the Orlop deck? That's, uh, the third, I guess? Okay. Oh, wait, I can't get down from here, can I? I gotta go the other way. Got my torn boy. All accounted for. If we go down one here and then go to the port deck. Which is left side of the boat. So if I'm facing the front of the boat, it's left side. Or wait, no, port's the right. I don't know nautical shit. <laughs> I think we know that much already. Isn't the port on the right or the left? Port is left. Okay, I should trust myself. I already opened this up. Do they mean the right side, though? Oh, shit. Port and left have the same amount of letters. So that's, oh, that's a good mnemonic device, yeah. Feels so silly now. This is the point I was sure I was going to reach where it's like, where is it? Where's the last piece? Nothing over there. Let's try another door. Nothing in here. Oh, man. It's right where you left it, of course. Of course. Oh, shit. Here we go. Lazarette. Shit. Yo, what the fuck? What is that? Hold on. I can't get in there. I've seen him a few times already. He's getting stabbed. They're all getting fucking stabbed. He dead. You dead, boy. There's another guy. I can't get back through to the- Dude, what the- It's a giant spider, man! That's a giant fucking spider! What the hell? Bitch, Shepard! I'm never sailing this cruise liner again, I don't blame you! What in the world is that? In the port walk. Oh, he died by... Spider stabbing. Welcome to the bear pile. Mailman man! Thank you very much for your Twitch Prime subscription, my friend. I appreciate that. Enjoy your badge and emotes. He was... What happened to this boy? He was... Speared? Not speared. He was... Hmm... Spiked? 
I wonder if we can see spiked by a t yeah, there it is, spiked by a terrible beast. That's fair, I guess. That seems reasonable. Someone shoot the damn thing. Wow! Yeah, you got stab a Rooney, dude. Here's my other boy. Hi. And you got stabbed too. This is getting real spoopy here. Zook! 11 months, it's almost a decade. Wow! Thank you for 11 months in a row, Zook. Appreciate it. Welcome on back in. Bear hugs, please. Get him cozy. He did. Mm hmm. I'm excited to see this, actually. I've got you. Don't move. I'll get you down. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. He got. Did they take it out? But it was... Oh my god, it was like launching those spikes at him, huh? That's cool. He did. Yeah, he's gonna hes gonna be dying from that. Sorry to say. The boy here looks like he met a grisly fate. Oh, wait a minute, is that... It's Charles! Midshipman Charles Hurstick! Mauled by a giant spider beast. Oh boy. They did what they could. Hmm. Upstairs? Oh god, I gotta get upstairs, run! No, no! Oh, there's nothing there. Okay, we're good. Okay. Do you My boy was spiked by a terrible oh, beast. to the bear pile. There am you! Gifts the sub to Squiggus. Thank you so much for the gifted subscription. I appreciate that. Very kind of you. My boy was spiked, and uh, he's got a butcher's apron on. I'm going to... Hold on. Who's the butcher? This is Emilio Farrell the butcher. I did it! Yeah! Woo! Oh, that is right. Great. Oh yeah, that no, I knew that. Progress! It does make me feel smart, yeah. I feel like a genius. Well then. That's my friend, uh, Charles. Looks like we're about to discover his fate. Makes you feel genius and a fool at the same time, yeah, aka my entire Twitch experience. Much more of the latter than the former. But a little bit of the former every now and then. That was a bit convoluted, wasn't it? That Brennan thing is that only one bullet hit him from that firing line. Oh my god, really? You're supposed to look at the trajectory of the bullets and notice that only one of the bullets actually hit. Oh, shit! Well, I just got a lucky guess then. Good old Brennan. That's funny. Okay, that's crazy. Yeah, that looks pretty gruesome. He burned to death? Yeah, yep, Charles burned to death. 
Looks like it was pretty necessary, I guess. Wow. He slew the beast with his sword. Damn, son. We don't have to go into emote only every death scene, by the way. I don't think that's necessary. I think chat's behaving for the most part. I can... I can tolerate a stray spoiler here and there. Thanks for looking out, though. Well, I mean, we kind of knew already, right? My boy Charles got... got annihilated. I kind of want to listen to it again, but... Let's have a look at what his options are. He was... Hmm. Burned. Charles Hirschdick burned to death. Yeah, I think that's... That's pretty close. Okay. Well, while it's given me the option to keep on finding out new stuff on our, by the game's hand, I suppose I should go ahead and keep taking it. It's good to piece together what we can while we can, though. Okay. A couple of them. If chat wants emote only mode in death scenes, then by all means, go for it. If that's your preference. Welcome to the bear pile. Wonder pits! Good God. What is the. Whoa! Did this? I can't decide if this looks like the this beast is emerging from this person. Either way, yeah, these two sorry fools. They got mauled by the giant spider. We Dark Souls now, yeah. How fucking freaky. Oh, this dude lit it on fire. That was Henry! Or Charlie! Charles! My boy Charlie! Burn it quick! These unknown souls were... Clawed by a terrible beast. Freaking champ. No kidding. Okay. Well. Giant enemy crab. Another spiker. I bet this is the guy we're gonna find next. Oh. 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 Yeah. Yeesh. Later on, silent. Thanks for hanging out. No, I can't go that way. Oh, I can't go that way. This whole time I could have gone that way. What's going on? 
on. Stay back. It's already on your neck. Hey. Come on, boss. No. Get there. Hey. Cats. This really looks like this beast like emerged from a member of the crew. Or it's just got this really weird personage attachment onto its torso. That's very strange. He was spiked. Looks like he's about to be spiked. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Someone riding it. Yeah, I guess so. It was for fun. Let's go upstairs real quick. Oh, there's two! Oh, shit! My boy got spiked. And demon. Hmm. It's already killed Nick, whoever that is. Whoever got spiked, don't actually know the name of. So, here's that. Hmm. I don't know what language that is. I feel like it's difficult to decipher with just those two words. Oh well. Another one! Mm-hmm. Oh, it was Danish? Huh, okay, so he must have been down there then. It's this guy. Gonna go ahead and go up there. The whole following the dust around things thing seems a little silly, unnecessary. You gotta watch it. You gotta see it. You just gotta see it. You have to. Oh, you actually do have to watch it to make a move. That's silly. Yep. They came out from the sea. Clearly. Huh. Oh, my lord. Yeah, you see this? Okay, so these are... It's not that they emerge from people. It's just that they've got these crazy-ass, like... Effigies of people. That operate as the controller of the beast or something? I don't know. They are people, yeah. Hey, Brennan! Crab centaurs, yeah, something like that. Might be how they lure people in, right? Yeah. Interesting. Well, some guys got stabbed and thrown. Spiked by a terrible beast. Okay, then. There's the other guy. Wow, look at it go. How magical. Yay, dust. Oh, this guy.
unknown soul was killed doing a sick flip. Yeah, he was in the middle of fu a fucking wicked gainer. Ba boom! He was electrocuted. Yo! That's cool. Lightning strike. We're walking along the rigging here. Yeah, I wonder how he died. Hmm. Oh, it's this guy again. Man, I don't know. You were clawed. Oh, you must have been downstairs. It's fun knowing the fates of all these people. Well, we definitely know that guy got electrocuted. That's easy enough. Some real top men up there, indeed. Top, top men. Main sail hauled up, secure the braces and lower the top sail, work fast, the wind is alive. We can maybe figure out who this is. Oh, this is a deduction rating. A higher rating means that it will be more difficult to deduce this person's identity. Focus on the easily deduced identities first and leave the more difficult ones for later. Okay, I guess so. Well, he did get struck by lightning, so we'll just go ahead and do that. Jobs! Come here! What do you got? You got a new toy! What's going on? You got a new penguin. Hang on, do we have the camera? I think I've got the camera. It's right there, yeah. Chubbs cam. Oh, he got that penguin! <laughs> Where you go, buddy? He's so cute. That's a cool new toy. Winter penguin. I went grocery shopping. Yeah, nice. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right. This game's good. Good? Yeah. There's Chubb's cam for you. I know everybody needed a sampling of that. Thanks, babe. Mm -hmm. Well. Is there struck by lightning? No. Torn apart? Poisoned? Electrocuted. There it is. This unknown soul was electrocuted. Yep. That looks like what happened. Torn apart by the lightning, yes. Hmm. Alright, I'm getting out of here then. Tased by God. All right, hey Murdoch, how are you? And off we go. Well, that gave us a lot of information, didn't it? Good sequence of events there. Let's see. So we know all about a. All the bullshit that happened below deck, too. But hold on, let's see. Oh, goodness, yeah. Doo -doo -doo. Do they still have heads? Because I noticed... I don't think he has a head anymore. No, it's there. I noticed that there was a decapitation option. Maybe these guys actually got decapitated. Doesn't look like it. Oh, great. They have high intuition checks. 
Whatever the hell that was. Okay. Okay. Giant enemy crab slash spider. Hmm. Well, we've not checked out this side. Starboard walk. Wow. I see. Yeah, I figure that's probably the case, huh, Doom? I should probably focus on trying to get the easy stuff first. Not go crazy with it. I've not been down here, is it? Or have I, rather? I don't think I've checked this out yet. Number three, then, right? This has got to be it. There we go. Terrific. The big old dead spider. is pretty badass, admittedly, but... Fuck. Yeah, don't spring to action now, buddy. Take your time. Oh, he's getting his sword ripped away from him. My goodness. Goes down killing the spider. We don't even know if he killed the thing. I don't know if that's a safe assumption here. Real Don I! Thank you so much for your five months of row. Welcome on back in, buddy. Appreciate it. Bear hugs, please. Appreciate you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the support. Who is this? The ultimate badass. A hideous monster perished simultaneously with a brave but unfortunate soul. It did indeed die. He was, uh... I guess... You'd call that Claude, right? No, that's really spiked. Spiked by a terrible beast. Not even really spiked. It's like... Hmm. I guess that is the best one. Yeah. Not eaten. Speared, I guess, maybe. But that's then, like... Speared by a tear. Yeah, I guess that works. Okay. And then we probably don't know who this is yet, so... There we go. And through the door. Do, do, do. Spiked and spear are similar enough. All right, good. Mm-hmm. Darian boy, hello there. Welcome on back. I'm loving it. It is excellent. It's good stuff. Nothing in here either. Okay. 
Later on, Blim, hey, thanks for hanging out. Glad you liked it. It is good stuff. Yeah, I encourage everyone to check this out, I think. It's real good. Those churros down there? Keep pressure here. Hold him down. What madness is this? Twenty years, my steward, and never a doubt on your sanity. Explain yourself. Those ungodly beasts carry a curse. Throw them back or doom us all. Throw them back. Him up and put him in the lazarette with those things. He may yet find his senses. Come on. All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. Where's the rest of his leg? The uh, fact that the audio is designed so deliberately as to allow you to hear who is talking by way of like the panning and the positioning of the voices. So I like that a lot. Where's the rest of his leg? Good God. <laughs> Put him in the lazarette with the with the rest of the beasts is what they're saying here, right? He was shot. We've got to have this has got to be the surgeon, right? He's the surgeon for sure. Oh, wait, no, 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 not, oh, wait, wait, the surgeon is the one doing the surgery, probably, right? Yeah. Oh, shit, so maybe I shouldn't label either one of the other two. I don't know which one is which. Damn it. Hmm. Yeah, I've been hearing that it doesn't really hurt to guess, so I suppose I might as well just go ahead and... Drop it there, figure it out later. He bled out, I guess. He was torn apart. Not decapitated. He was torn apart by a beast, I think. Let's see. Hold him down. 20 years, my steward, and never down. Tie him up and put him in the lazarette. And there's, uh, where's the rest? All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. Who's John? John's not the one with the missing leg, I don't think. Been in worse spots, I think. wonder how many Johns there are. You. You might be John. John Davies, the fourth mate. I think there's only one John. Yeah. Oh, no, hold on. John Naples. Damn it. All right. Can't do that, then. I don't even know if that was John, either. That is... Oh, yeah, I know him. That's Alfred Klestel. All right, then. All right, then. Whole bunch of shit going on up here. Ridiculous. I guess for the for presentation's sake, this is fine. But let me just let me go get him. Oh, 
That was his missing foot that you pocket watched. Oh, shit. Wow. Uh... He just... <laughs> Uh-oh. That's unfortunate. That's like a, the catch of the day, too, isn't it? Or is that a person? I'm pretty sure that's just like a fish. Fucking clobbered. Yeah, dude. Smushed. Who's this? No idea. Cause of death. Feel down the stairs and ravioli all over himself. Oh, it's the artist. Rushing to get a look. There's the butcher. The butcher, the artist, the captain, all in a row. Hello. Fucking whomped. Power man! Ravioli all over him. Thank you, buddy, for the hunter bitch. Right, later on, chill, Reef. How'd they die? Crushed. Crushed by cargo. Womp womp. Another one. Him. Blom. Upsy daisy. Right? Right? No, oh, right there. Okay. And two people died at once during this accident, clearly. Not well handled. Shell here. Whoops. The fuck even happened? What? Fish slapped him in the face. He got punished. Bitch slapped by a fish. Okay. Dude got whacked and everybody collapsed. Cru oh, this guy was the, the the cause of it all. Slapped by a fish, absolute honker. Oh my god. He didn't just die, he post-mortem killed the other guy. Yeah. Holy mackerel. This man was thoroughly owned. He was struck by the tail. Well, that's not wrong, is it? This unknown soul was struck dead by a beast's tail. Give him to me and I can fry us a solid meal. Oh, you know, he might be the cook. He might be the cook. Thomas Sefton. We've only got one. Thomas Sefton was struck dead by a beast tail. I watched it happen. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, the fact that he said, I can fry us up a meal, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's safe to say that's the cook. Hmm.
Two guys here, if I recall correctly. Mm hmm. We've yet to see this surgeon save a single life. He's been there on the scene, though, at least. What the hell is going on? What do you know about these things? About the chest and your dead friends? This is me. The shell must be protected. Shell? What shell? There was a pretty shell. Oh yeah, a pretty shell down below. I remember that. Why did that happen? Spikes from here. Oh, shit. Did they capture one of the beasts and bring it on board? Well, that was stupid. What'd they do that for? Ooh, that was close. Ooh, look at that. So close. This one right here, though. He, they got hit. Yep. They got hit. Stell Simmons! Thanks for the streams and the VODs these past 18 months. Thank you for the 18 months of subscription. I appreciate that. Spiked. By a beast. Spiked. By a beast. Let this sound take a below. This sounds like where they're from. This tells everything. Very dangerous shell. This one is the one that died. Hmm. Hmm. Is this the captain? I think this is the captain. Yes. Who are you? Part of the Formosan royalty. I already identified two of them. I think there were only four... of them aboard, right? Hold on. Let me have a quick look. Yeah. I could probably just guess. They're passengers. Oh, so they're not, they're not gonna be in the crew, right. Right. Okay. Okay, I see. Yeah. Well, I probably don't know then. I think I need a little more information there. This guy also is showing up more commonly. A few down here as well. Who are you? Oh. I see. Okay. Right. This might help us rule it down then. Finding out what happened to him.
Boop. That didn't work. Who the fuck shot him? You! You did it! Ooh, I'm flying! Whee! Don't shoot! Bang! Ah, wow, well, that didn't work. Is that a mermaid? What the fuck? What do they got going on over here? The shell! My oh my. He's dead. He was shot by this man. Who is that? got another dead guy aboard this dude a shell of a tragedy ah ah okay Let's see if I've gathered enough information here to maybe make some determinations. He was shot. By... Man, I, I feel like I should be able to guess. But I don't know. I don't know. Get the captain. They're back. Recover the boats. Don't shoot. And then he gets shot. God damn it. Right. Uh, yeah. Do, 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 do. Guessing is resin. Yeah, you know, we gotta deduce. We can't just throw names out there. Until I decide that's what the procedure's gonna be. And then I hopefully just get things right on a whim. Yeah, I think the X just means it's the person that died, right, Hippo? Shoot ya. Shoot ya. Calling out for Miss Lim. Oh, whoops. You can probably guess his name. What in the world? He's pulling out like these mer creatures. This is wacky. And there's Miss Lim. A renewal. Seventy-three is the best number. What are you gonna do? Shoot me? Right? <laughs> All right. Well, I guess I might just guess. Yeah, I'm gonna get banned on YouTube too. Damn it! I guess I might just guess. Just go ahead and toss a name on this fella, right? Probably him. Why not? Why not? But how did he die? How did he die? I don't know. Hmm. 
expired from old age. No, I'm pretty sure that's not what happened. <laughs> uh, I think I have to wait. Oh, it's Miss Lim. That death roulette bet never wins. Hey, every once in a while, you know it does. Yeah, I know, I know, I can't go out there. Can you come back? Where's Miss Lim? There we go. Thank you. Folk conjoining their powers. Oh my. What have you done? We sacrificed these men? They were harpooned. This one through the chest, this one through the face, I think. Or stabbed? Is that a sword? Or a knife, maybe. I can't see exactly what's gotten into him. <laughs> what's gotten into him? <laughs> hmm. Speared, maybe, yeah. Got a couple dead bodies there. Bunan Lim, I still don't know what happened to her. Hmm. I don't think... I can label it yet. I think I just need to keep getting context clues here and hopefully we'll solve it by the end of things. She died. Oh. Oh. Names. Yay, names. Oh shit. He was speared. I also might know his name now. Look at that pretty face. Ooh, yeah. What is he doing? Is he trying to, like, protect this one? Can't quite tell. Oh, lured in. Oh, shit. He looks as though he was, uh, taken away. He's cowering in fear. This one was speared. Very much so, through the neck. Well, all right. Mm-hmm. Who is this? How did they die? Nichols, sir, shoot them for God's sake. Hmm. Oh, Hagen, you're still breathing. Can you row? This is the guy that died. And who is this? Let's find out. That, I believe, was this guy over here. Yep, that's him. How did he die? 
I think we have to find out now. This this boy was speared in the face. Keep rowing. Where is there? Something there. I see it. Give us a weapon. Shoot My kid I. Pick up the oars and row, you fools. Whoa, damn. Well, that certainly explains that, doesn't it? Yeah, another name there too, right. He was speared in the throat. Yeah, good shot. Still smoking a corn cob pipe in the midst of all this. Got LeBron, yes sir. Oh, he got speared too, it seems. By this one. But that was early on. Yep, okay. That's our boy, the uh, one we're looking for from before. Looks like he's going down to the beast. Are they, he's tied up? Why is he tied up? Interesting. It is Beng, yeah, so I think we got the right name on that one. Still don't know how she died. She's probably being held hostage too, right? Yeah, it looks like they were both tied up. Okay, let's see. Who is this? How did they die? I think that's the dude that got stabbed in the throat, right? Let me go make sure. Oops. Yep, okay, great. Uh, please. There we go. <laughs> Speared! By a terrible beast. Okay. So, do I know his name, maybe? Hmm. Keep rowing. There's something there. I see it. Pick up the oars and row. I don't know if we've got his name. I want to say, like, O'Hannigan. Because there is... Oh, Hagen. I wonder if I listened to it again, if I could hear an Irish accent. Hmm. All right, yeah, we have a Russian as well. Okay, that's interesting. Speared like a pickle rick, uh-huh. Hmm. He was already down when the other guy was calling for O'Hagan, okay. Yeah, you're probably right about that. Who would be the captain in this scenario? I wonder. Maybe you? Yeah, it's probably him. Okay. It was the Captain Nichols? Oh my god, what am I doing? That would have been him, yeah. Edward Nichols was shot with a gun, but not killed out here. And then, let's see. I do think I actually have the correct name for this guy now. It bangs, yeah. And then, let's see. He got speared as well. He was taken off. I think I've got another set of names. Or not another set of names, but at least like one name to issue, to issue, but I just don't know who. So I'm just gonna go ahead and proceed. I think there is a drowned option, yeah. Aye, sir. Check the load of the missile. Good. Stay quiet and alert. If the wind picks up, we've no chance against the Oberdin. Shoot ya! Be one swabble! 
Oop, there he goes. Hmm. So he can speak Chinese, or at least understands Chinese. He dodges the- oh, look at that! Yeah, holy shit! Dodges the spear. Inches away. Nice. Do, 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 do. Well, we know how he died for sure. That's badass, man. There they are. Do, do, do. We got one piece. Yeah, it looks like Lin is tied up. Okay. I don't know who this is still, but he got speared by a beast. Keep course due east. Mm hmm. Yeah, not a lot else from this. I wonder if maybe... No, there's too many others. No chance. Alright then. That's that. Hell of a lot going on here. Can we have a color change? I think I'm going to stick with this. I don't want to totally throw myself for a loop mid-game. Well, there's probably other stuff I could piece together here. But I'm kind of leaning toward just exiting and uh, reconvening on the Oberdin. So let's do that. See what the game has in store next. Hey, Kaylee. Still going. This game's good. It's a good, good game. Okay. So let's see. You have enough information to determine every Formosan's identity now. All right, yeah, we might want to consider doing that. Let's see. Two, three, four. He's the last one. Nice. All right. Mm-hmm. My boy Charles. Now you know who killed Nichols, right? Yeah, there's another piece. Okay. So let's see. Go to the crew. Go to Nichols. Uh, can I not? I guess I can't click him from there. So let's go to. Where would that have been? Click fate. Oh, you can do it from there? The crew, Nichols. Ah, here we go. Yeah, thank you. Oh, but do we know who shot him? I feel like I have to go back and see it. Is there a way to, like, look at that piece again quickly? Nine memories. Memories where this person appears can be navigated from here. Ah, yeah, here we go. Uh, oh, and then show the part where he perished. Right, yeah, that's cool. 
Nice. He said don't shoot me, right? Yeah. There he is. Shot by Chiotan. Done. Okay. There's that. This is not sponsored, correct? Okay. So we figured that part out. Huh. Now I have no idea what to do. <laughs> That felt good, to get all those pieces, right? But now we just gotta figure out what the next step is. Literally one memory left. Oh, okay, well we might as well go find, it, find that, right? In the bottom of the boat, okay. Let's go get it. No, not that one. Not behind the locked door either, right? Do, 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 do. Review the one star difficulty entries. Yeah, that's probably smart. There we go. Bottom of the boat? Is there like a ladder in the middle or something? No. Hmm. Flies, right? Yeah. Uh, it's just a maze. I guess I need to just investigate the nooks and crannies. So I've been in here. Wow! Dan Giesling Raiders, wow! Dan Raid! Dan Giesling Raiders. Hello, welcome. Thanks for joining us. Hi, I'm Bear Taffy. Playing some Return of the Oberdeen. The watch trigger. He lifted the watch in the room. That was, uh, was that a corpse I've already seen? Right? I thought so. Or was it in the other room? It was not. Oh shit. Dragon! To the bear pile. It is this room. Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Sorry, I was paying attention to the Dan raid. Oh, here it is. Dragon, thank you for the subscription. Appreciate it, buddy. Dan, thanks for the raid. Welcome, everybody. Huh. Yeah, he dead. Crushed. Crushed to death. Oof. Hello. Ah, he's guarding the royalty in here, I see. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's Solomon. Do, 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 do. Whoa! What happened? Huh? Oh no! He died! A horrible, painful death. Thanks, Lars. Well, the, well done. Hoisting that up. Lars is 100% responsible for that death. Loose cargo. Mackay! Damn it, Lars. An unidentified stowaway, expecting free passage and eventual freedom, was instead crushed inside a falling barrel. 
I don't even get to identify it myself? Okay. Fair enough. Got another one, though. Oh, he's right here. This is I thought this was the guy that we just did. He has no identity, yeah. Didn't even exist before. Oh, the other guy's in the barrel. Oh, shit. That's next level. <laughs> this ship is just full of the clumsiest fucking idiots. Oh my god. Hi! Look out below! Oh, he died! Whoopsie. Now that's an ouchies. That's a big, uh, that's a big whoops. Oh. Three gone! Gifting the subscription to Murdoch26. Appreciate that, buddy. Welcome on in. Thanks for the support. Bear hugs, please. It's a big old whoopso right there. That's a whoopsie doodle. Oh well. Who is this? No names announced. But he was crushed by cargo. Well, all right then. Not a lot else I can do down here. All righty. Catalog of Adventure and Tragedy. Mm-hmm. All right. Boys! Get in there somewhere! Storm's coming! Finish your business and climb down here! I see. Found all the corpses you could. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Now the real game begins. So it's just up to us to deduce, I suppose, at this point then, right? Oh, that's neat. What a cool rain effect. I like that. I'm guessing, um... This doesn't, like, end the game, so I'm gonna head down here and see what he says. Oh, don't go down there until you're absolutely ready. Oh, well, whoops. All done. We should go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Coming back. If you're still business here, climb up and finish it. Else I'll make to port. Oh, okay, we can go. No big deal. All right, then. So I suppose... If you let it leave, it does actually give you a hint that could be useful. Oh, 
Interesting. I suppose then I should just go ahead and rewatch a couple of scenes and see if there's maybe other pieces I can put together. But looks like now it's just pretty much on me to figure it all out. Okay. Well, let's have a look at the storyline. Loose cargo dropped, killed a couple people. All of a sudden they got sick, a couple of people succumbed to the illness. Haven't identified who this is yet. A large cow was slaughtered for its meat, I remember that. This unknown soul was knifed by the second mate, Edward Nichols. He was shot right, yeah, by Henry Brennan. Shot with a gun by an unknown attacker. I should look through and see if there's any uh, unknown souls that I haven't identified yet. This guy, I still don't know how he died. Because I'm looking at this. Maybe this was O'Hagan, maybe not. You know that knifed soul. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, try to prioritize the guy with one triangle above their picture. I don't know who that is yet, hang on. Let's see, if there's any... Yeah, how did she die? We still don't know who this is, or how she died either. He avoided death as far as I could tell. Hmm. I think that's right. It's unknown soul. Uh huh. Unknown soul. Oh, here we go. 20 years, my steward, and never a doubt on your sanity. And the Lazarette. This might be John. It says his name. Maybe that's John Davies. There's probably another John, though. John Naples. Yeah, so we don't know for sure. Damn. But I think it's... Safe to say... Well, hold on. Man. There's a lot going on now. Welcome back. Dovian! Thanks for six months in a row, buddy. Appreciate that. Yeah, one's, a, one's an officer, which made me think... It'd be easier to figure out that way. This unknown soul. Up there. Interesting. Another one triangle. Man. Clubbed by an unknown attacker. Lars Lind. Hit by this guy. Wonder if we watched this again, if we would be able to figure out who that was. The artist was crushed, we know that. Hmm. He is Danish, yeah, we know that. Oh wait, wasn't he? Lars was the Dane. So that doesn't help us as far as who it is that attacked him. As far as I know yet. Okay. Leave the ship and return the book to me. I see. Hmm. 
Oh, yeah, the killer had a brother. Very true. So, hold on. Let me go back. That seems like it might be the piece that I can figure out here. Let me on. You killed my brother. Lars killed this guy's brother. But it's not necessarily true that this guy and his brother were both on there. But Samuel and Nathan Peters immediately stand out to me. Brother of the guy who got clouded by the cargo that fell. Mmm. Mm-hmm. I think it's it I think it's pretty safe to assume that they wouldn't include the brothers' information if they weren't both on the ship. So it's gotta be one of these two. For cases like this, you should just guess one of them. Yeah, it seems right. All right. Well, let's just leave that for now. Get a little further down this way. Right, yeah, we need three correct guesses for it to tell me. Maybe the brother was in the scene where the cargo fell? Yeah, possible, huh? Right, yeah, because Lars was the one responsible. Nice! Well, that was lucky. Okay, we did get nickels. Not surprising. There it is. That's deduction, I suppose, right? Yeah. It was deduction that got us to that point, but luck that I chose the correct brothers in each circumstance, I think. Okay. Cool. Here's that. Let's see. Paul Moss was killed with a sword by an unknown attacker. Paul, look out. Mm-hmm. Shot with a gun by an unknown attacker, yeah. Let's see. Club by Henry Brennan. Work on chapter three, you say? That one there is a, uh, that's a one triangle. Who is this? Playing the fiddle. In the scene. Hmm. Oh, uh, yeah, I just ignore. What are you doing down here? Hmm. Signor. Means sir? Ah. Read that next entry again. You've been found guilty by self-confession of the murder of Nuncio Pasqua. He's done nothing wrong. He's captain of this ship and by authority of the East India Company. That's the Crown of England. Since you death by Mr. Firing. Oh, Mr. Wolf. That's right. No, 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 no. That's not Mr. Wolf. We already identified Mr. Wolf. that guy, right? Yeah, okay. Duh. There's that, okay. 
self admit self confession. Okay. Okay. The ship's crew was a bit racist. Seems that way, yeah. Hmm. Well. I don't really even know, like, where to begin here. I think a fresh mentality may help. I think I might want to save this for a day two sort of situation. So I can uh, analyze what we've got.